Hi and good morning. Yeah, today we are taking a little walk. And uh, today is the 8th of June 2021. And I've been talking about arising and shining. And as you can see from the background there, the sun has come out and it is ready to shine as always. I have always said, even when we don't see the sun on a cloudy day, it has come out and it's shining. So today I'm looking at the last letter. You see, go through the list of the arise and shine, being courageous, being committed, looking for opportunities and all the other words I've been talking about throughout this uh, season, a few weeks now. And I'm coming to the mid of the year, so I need to think of another word that will take me through the rest of the year. But for now, we will arise and shine. And yesterday we stopped at thankfulness and being teachable. But today I'm looking at the letter Y. And Y for me is yielding to yield. When you look around this field here, you can see this is wheat. And these seeds must have died to be able to produce what they're producing now, to be able to yield more. They died. And that's what I believe in the spiritual sense. The Bible says about being born again. It's like dying with Christ at baptism. We die with Christ and then we resurrect. We are born again without the death of Jesus Christ and without the resurrection. We wouldn't be having a new life. The one that we have in Christ, we wouldn't be having Christianity as we know it. So it's about dying and being born again, arising and shining in the newness of life. In the physical sense, we know that people invest something. So they yield something to be able to bear something, to be able to have a home, they yield something. And in the commercial world, in the intellect world, we pay, we invest some things to be able to gain profits. And also in our relationships, we invest time and we invest something. So we yield to yield, we give in, we give up, we give things to be able to gain other things. So have a wonderful day, a yielding to yield day and be productive, be fruitful. Above all else, love is on top of the list. God bless you and have a wonderful day. Amen.